Al-Qaeda in Settle Community High School. Myself and my team will be supporting your young people as they come up after the summer and working closely with primary schools to help with transition. I just want to introduce you to Mrs Bate, who is Head of Support. Thanks, Mrs Donnelly. Uh, I'm Mrs Bate, Head of Support here at Community High School. I oversee our Department of Additional Support and Mainstream Support, and I'm going to talk a wee bit more about how we can support individual pupils when they come up to the Support for Learning staff work with a large number of pupils across the school in a number of different ways. If your child has an additional support need, the primary school will have highlighted that to us and through meetings with the class teacher or the primary support for learning teacher, we will draft what we call a support for learning profile and this will have details of your child's additional support needs and a number of strategies that have worked well for them in the past and this will be shared with all staff in school so that they are aware of your child's needs and how they can best help them. A copy of this will be shared with parents and carers and this will be regularly reviewed. We have a number of teachers within Support for Learning. We have Mrs Callaghan, Miss Lowe, Mrs Darragh and Mr Hudson who does some outdoor learning with pupils. We also have a PSA team who support pupils in their classes and also to get to classes, to get between classes. And they might also work with them um, in small groups within the class or if the class teacher would like them to work um, in a quieter room elsewhere. We're also very lucky in that we have two youth workers who are based in the school. Um, we have Maggie Skelly and Stuart Cumming from Community Learning and they again work with a number of our pupils who are referred via their guidance teacher. Our aim is to make pupils as independent as possible so that we can prepare them for life after school. So we hope that we, where possible, can use technology to help aid their learning and to help them with strategies. For example, using a digital reader on the computer and knowing how to use WordTalk and Microsoft Word or Immersive Reader which is available too. If you have any questions about your child's coming up to a community with regards to support for learning, then please don't hesitate to get in touch. The guidance team is a key part of the school system at Ocnuti. We work closely with the class teachers the support for learning team and the senior management team along with our partner agencies to support our young people with their health and well-being, attainment and destinations. Assisting them to develop their skills and qualities alongside their academic attainment helping to prepare them for their next steps into a positive and sustained destination. I'm proud to be part of a highly committed guidance team who worked hard to get to know the young people in their house, providing parents and carers with a point of contact to assist with any needs or issues that may arise throughout the young person's school career. Within the school, we have five houses, Balgone, headed by Mr Moyes, Balmoral, headed by Mr Lumsden, Glams is Mr Calhoun, Ravenscraig is myself, Mrs Donnelly, and Weems is Mrs Kitchen. All students are allocated a house, and if you have any siblings at high school, you will be in the same house. Students are encouraged to seek out their guidance teacher if they wish to talk. 
We can be found in the A1 in room A014 and we would encourage young people to make an appointment via the new QR code system that you will find on the house posters located throughout the school. And this is a quick and easy way to make an appointment and your guidance teacher will get back to you as soon as they can. We're very aware at the moment that students are understandably very anxious about coming up to high school. They may be worried about their classes. Are they going to have any friends? Are they going to get lost? What are teachers going to say if they arrive late? How much homework are we going to get? All these sorts of things. But please be assured that the majority of our young people quickly settle into secondary life. And that we are on hand if there are any concerns that you have. I would urge you to contact your child's guidance teacher if you have any concerns. Students will be allocated a guidance teacher prior to the summer, but should you have any questions at present, please direct them to your primary school who will liaise with one of ourselves. We are looking forward to welcoming our new young people in the autumn.